today we'll be making roast chicken we have already seasoned the chicken with regular all-purpose seasoning a little salt meat season chicken spice and as I said all-purpose the chicken needs to be seasoned from overnight so the um, season can get absorbed at least I guess two hours two to 24 hours would be good we, we refrigerate and then bring to room temperature for at least an hour before um, putting in the oven The chicken I think we have what 20 minutes um, 22 minutes to go let's see how we're looking looking very good all right we have the sauce made I like to make my sauce before the meat is ready you know so I'm not in this rush rush the, the sauce is ready and prepared so as soon as the chicken comes out of the oven I'll just pour it on and return the chicken to the oven all right as I said the um, sauce is made up of tomato ketchup a little store-bought barbecue sauce a little bit of maple syrup splash of hot sauce some sugar and I actually had some orange juice in the fridge so I put like about four or five tablespoons all right that would you can see where it's a little bit liquidy this is due to the orange juice but this is quite fine okay just another peek of the chicken looking very well coming along nicely all right the chicken is ready let me just remove this to the counter All right, here we have the chicken half done. I want to cut the chicken up into pieces before I return it to the oven. However, I do not want all the juices to come out seeing that it just came out of the oven. We're gonna give this like 30 minutes to rest and then we're gonna cut the chicken up and put the sauce on. All right, we'll be making a very simple salad to accompany the chicken. And uh, can I tell you, everything I have here came from my backyard, including the chicken. So I'm very, very, very proud of that. So, you know, now I know what my kids eat, what we all eat. Let's do some carrots. Okay, and I also have some mango in the fridge, so I'm going to add that too. To just add that to the salad. just 
just give this a quick toss. Very quick, easy, and simple. Um, we get our vitamins and minerals here. We have our carrots, our cucumber, lettuce, and some mango. So we get sugar here also. So we, there's no need for a salad dressing. All right, I'm just going to put this away into the refrigerator for now. And let's finish the chicken. All right, here we have our chicken. It's not so hot to be touched anymore. We're just going to do a quick uh, cut up and return to the pan. Right here we have our chicken all cut up and by the way remember we did not add any paprika or browning or soy sauce or anything like that to alter the um color of the chicken this was just all natural right but it's you it's optional but we did get a nice color from the um chicken as it was all right let's now add the sauce All right, there's no need for any baster or anything like that. We're just gonna take a spoon and pour the um, sauce over the chicken. All right, I have turned the oven back on, but we have reduced the temperature. We'll now be using, what, 300 or maybe 325 for 20 to 30 minutes. I will monitor at 20 minutes to see if we need the additional 10 minutes, but um, here we go. Okay, this is our chicken about to go back into the oven. I will um, just do 325 for 30 minutes. As you might have noticed, I did not boil the sauce prior to adding it to the chicken. It would have been, you know, nice and thick and glazed like for now, but. Okay, so here we have the finished product. I spooned the glaze that was in the bottom of the pan on the chicken, at least the sauce. Alright, here we have the finished meal. My simple garden salad with my roast chicken or some might even call it barbecue chicken because of the addition of the um, sauce or baked chicken so um, either way Um, we are we have served a um, thigh with a wing. All right, bon appetit.